In this video, we're going to install a Trio cabinet, including the frame. Now, in the UK and probably the world over, we never seem to have enough storage space inside bathrooms and shower rooms. And we have got this void here, of course, which we can make use of, which means we don't have to worry about putting a surface mounted cabinet on. So we keep everything neat. And we've got a really clever solution to this. The studs which run up beside either the WC frame or the basin frame can be utilized to fit this preformed module in, which can be fixed to the wall at this stage before we do the boarding and then we board up to it and then we've got a little lip there to tile to. And that means we've got a ready-made opening, but at this stage, we don't have to put the cabinet in. We can leave that to last knock ins to all the work's been done and then just slip that bath cabinet in as our last job. It's a really professional solution. And as a plumber, I would be challenged to do this in timber, but using this system, it's really easy. I'm going to show you how to take the box off this because it is important. Some people get this wrong. Now, this is the cabinet and the cabinet's heavy. So, what we need to do, turn it over. And remove the box. So this is a Wend recess cabinet. It comes in six different colors. And if you want the door to open the other way, all you've got to do is flip it through 180 degrees. And the great thing is that because it's put into this frame, it means that it's centered absolutely dead center on that WC. Mm -hmm. 